Magandang buhay mga bata! Tara! Samaanin niyo ako matutok kasama si... Teacher Aika, your online teacher. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell for more videos. Thank you! Revised K-12 Curriculum Science Grade 3 Quarter 2 Lesson 1 Day 3 Our topic for today is about Science in Our Daily Life This is Teacher Aika, your online teacher. Let's start! Learning Competencies the learners use the skills of observing, predicting, and measuring in performing simple guided science activities. Learning Objectives To describe objects based on their color, shape, and texture. Ang Misteryong Bayong Find out what objects are inside the mystery basket. Listen to your teacher for further instructions. How did you estimate the size and weight of the objects yesterday? Yesterday's lesson taught you how to compare and estimate the size and weight of objects using your sense of sight and sense of touch. In today's activity, they will be using similar observation skills in describing objects in more detail based on their color, shape, and texture. Yesterday, we used this basket to compare the size and weight of objects, but today, we will look at them in a different way. What do you think the object feels like? Answer, I think it feels smooth and soft. Can you guess its shape just by touching it? Answer, yes. By touching an object, I can guess its shape. If it feels round and smooth, it might be a ball. What color is it? Answer, it is red. It must be an apple. How would you describe its shape and texture now that you can see it? Answer, it is round and smooth just like I thought. Get ready to explore because in today's lesson, you will find objects and describe their color, shape, and texture using your senses. Texture, how something feels, like smooth, Rough, soft, or hard? Triangular Shaped like a triangle with three sides. Rectangular Shaped like a rectangle with four sides. A rough object, example, a coconut shell, or a smooth object, example, a mango. 
A triangular object, example, a slice of watermelon. A rectangular object, example, a biscuit. Now that we know these words, let us use them to describe different objects today. How can you describe the object's color, shape, and texture? Answer I can describe the color, shape, and texture of an object using my sense of sight and touch. Activity number three, scavenger hunt. Where are these objects? Materials. Per learner, notebook, pen, drawing materials. Per group, group data notebook. Part A, Station 1, per learner. First, look around you. Second, look for a yellow, red, orange, green, or blue object. Question 1. What is the object? Question 2. What is its color? Third, draw and label it in your notebook. Fourth, now look for an object with any of the following colors. Yellow, red, orange, green, or blue. Its shape should be round, rectangular square, oval, or triangular. Fifth, draw and label it in your notebook. Question 3. What is the object? Question 4. Describe its color and shape. Part B, Station 2. Prepare. First, look around you. Second, find a smooth object. Question 5. What is the object? Third, find a rough object. Question 6. What is the object? Fourth, find an object that is smooth and round. Fifth, draw and label it in your notebook. You observed different objects and described their color, shape, and texture using your senses. Now, let us think about how we use these skills in real life. Which activities at home do you use your sense of sight and touch to describe objects, color, shape, and texture? Answer, when I organize my school bag, I look at the color of my notebooks and feel if they are thick or thin. Can you think of games you used your skill to describe objects' color, shape, and texture? Answer, in the game, guess it. We touch an object while blindfolded and try to guess what it is by feeling its shape and texture. And that wraps up today's lesson. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more content like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss an update. Thanks for tuning in.